the tea is exceptionally good today. <laughs> Who made this? Mm, mm, very delicious. Hold on. Mm. Mm. Hello, y'all. Welcome back to my channel. Now, I'm sure a lot of you were shocked, or maybe not, when August Alsina revealed the details of his alleged relationship, or at least at the time, alleged relationship with Jada Pinkett Smith. Now, in the tell-all interview with Angela Yee, August Alsina claimed that he was in a long-term relationship with Jada Pinkett Smith that lasted years and that Will Smith allegedly gave him, or them, their blessing. Take a look at this clip. I actually sat down with Will and had a conversation due to the transformation from their marriage to life partnership that they've spoken on several times and it, you know, not involving romanticism. Mm -hmm. He gave me his blessing and I, I totally gave myself to that relationship for years of my life, you know, and I truly and really, really deeply loved and have a ton of love for her. Um, I, I devoted myself to it. I gave my full self to it. So much so to the point that I can die right now and be okay with knowing that I truly gave myself to somebody. Right, you did the right thing. And I really- Now y'all just heard August Alsina profess his love for Jada and how he spoke with such reverence and his tone was just that of love. But I want y'all to spot the difference when you watch his next clip and how Jada talks about August and their, well, you'll see what she calls it, and we'll get into that. I got into a different kind of entanglement mm -hmm. with August. And one thing I want to get clear about and clean up, one of the things that was kind of swirling in the press about you giving permission which is, uh, you know, the only person that can give permission in, in, in that particular uh, uh, yes. circumstance is myself. Yes, exactly. Yeah. But what August was probably trying to communicate, mm -hmm. because I could actually see how he would perceive it as permission because we were separated mm -hmm. amicably. Yeah. And I think he also wanted to make it clear that he's not a homewrecker. Mm -hmm. Which he's not. You and I decided we were going to take our space and what happened. Yeah, and then I got into an entanglement with August. That's what I said. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A relationship. Yes, it was a yeah. relationship. Absolutely. I was in a lot of pain and I was very broken. Now, in the process of that relationship, I definitely realized that you can't find happiness outside of yourself. Mm -hmm. And luckily enough, you and I were also going through a process of healing in a much different manner. Mm -hmm. I would definitely say we did everything that we could to get away from each other, only mm -hmm. to realize that that mm -hmm. wasn't mm -hmm. possible. It had been so long mm -hmm. since I felt good. Yeah. And it was really a joy to just help heal somebody. Yeah. I think that has a lot to do with my codependency, which is another thing that I had to learn to break in this cycle, just mm -hmm. that idea of needing to fix and being drawn to people that need help. He decided to break all communication with me, right. which was totally understandable. But really, an entanglement? That was some foul stuff, considering that August spoke about the relationship as if, because it was in fact a relationship, let's start there. As it was the best thing that ever happened to him in his life. And here's Jada speaking to her husband about her ex-boyfriend, almost mockingly, as if, you know, hey, it was fun. It was nice to fix someone who was broken. And, you know, it was quite the entanglement. What's an entanglement? I've never heard of that. But I guess, you know, props to her for keeping it real about how she felt and showing us and hopefully August that this whole thing was very one-sided to begin with. But along with confirming that she did, in fact, have a relationship 
with August Alsina, they also discussed the question of Will giving August his blessing. And they articulated that Will never in fact gave August the thumbs up, but rather it was a misunderstanding. Now I can understand how it could be a misunderstanding because Jada stated that her and Will had an amicable separation. And I assume that the environment that they produced within that separation may have led August to believe that, you know, well, he knows that I'm dating his wife and he's done nothing, he said nothing, he's all, you know, cool with me, then he obviously doesn't care and he, he's happy that we're doing what we do. Now, the question of whether Will gave his blessing, is what we're going to call it, directly or subliminally, I don't really think it changes anything. You stating, hey, I don't want you having a relationship with my wife, or you just silently nodding and just being a bystander for years, allowing your wife to have a relationship with another man in front of you, I think it's the same thing. But hey, that's, that's just me. All in all, I think that Jada was very honest because as carefree and nonchalant as she was talking about their entanglement and how she really really had a joy in fixing this broken person which I don't I don't think she did much of to be honest it just showed like that she really didn't care for the relationship in the way that August did and why it broke him and he did all those things to try to get her attention and why even now he's still bringing it up but y'all let me know how y'all feel about this in the comments do y'all feel like Jada used August or do you think that Will did in fact give August his blessing? But I hope that this video finds you in peace and leaves you enlightened. Thank you for tuning in. Make sure you subscribe. Bye.